Head of the Oromia Agriculture and Natural Resource Bureau with the rank of Vice President of the region, Omar Usse, said religious fathers should extend their effort in the rehabilitation process of displaced citizens. Guji's own religious fathers and Gimbi preparatory school students have supported displaced citizens. Olkaba Wendemu takes up your own tolerance report. Religious leaders of Guji Zone have supported 200,000 birr to rehabilitate the displaced Oromo citizens from Ethiopia and Somali regional state. The religious leaders said, till the citizens are fully rehabilitated, their support will continue. We used to collect many from mosques in our zone, which is worth 200,000 birr. It is not much, but it has a message as we are with them. Meanwhile, students and teachers of Gimbi Preparatory School also supported 100,000 birr. They also said their support will continue as well. We used to fundraising to support our displaced citizens by using different mechanisms of fundraising. Totally, we have collected 100,000 birr. Dr. Abarat Iresa, chairperson of the Rehabilitation Committee, thanked the Guji Zone religious leaders and teachers and students of Gimpi Preparatory School for contributing their fair share. I have full confidence upon you to continue your support until those citizens are rehabilitated. With Zanko, Vice Vice President and Head of the Oromi Agriculture and Natural Resource Bureau, Omar Hussein Foris Pass said, the participation of all citizens in support of the displaced citizens is amazing. We realize that our people can meet everything when there is unity. Whatever happened to our people, it doesn't break our unity. A tough special message for everyone so that unity is expressed by different angles, like keeping peace and security, by keeping our values enormous and helping each, helping each other. We have learned all these things at one.